University receives low scores because of the debt students are graduating with. The recent report finds Central State University graduates are leaving with lots of college loans. Two News reporter Pierre Edme is digging deeper into why CSU's degree is costing so much. While Central State University is the least expensive public university in Ohio, it could cost your kids the most. The latest U.S. Department of Education college scorecard also finds most students don't leave with a degree. Scores are out, and Central State University is at the bottom of the list. U.S. Department of Education says in the Buckeye State, CSU graduates have the highest college debt from federal loans, nearly $39,000. It's about eleven dollars to $17,000 more than other state institutions. And of those enrolled at CSU, 25% graduate. They give us a quality education and they give us internships here so they have us ready for the work world. Um, I have $20,000 in debt leaving out of here. I don't think that's that bad. Um, it's just the price of a car. That's how I look at it. Um, it's interesting statistics, but everyone has their own lifestyle or choice and you have to make the best of what you have. I made several requests for an on-camera interview with school administrators. A spokeswoman declined and offered instead a phone interview or a statement. Part of the statement, quote, while the college scorecard looks at the median federal debt that a student has, to gain a clearer picture of student debt, one should look at total borrowing, which includes non-federal and federal loans, end quote. CSU also reports 88% of its students are eligible for the federal Pell Grant program. After money from that grant, plus other federal, state, and college aid, on average, a student's bill comes to a little more than $11,000. Graduating senior India Harris says some students don't have financial literacy tools or apply for scholarships. The university offers classes to help with that. Harris says she is willingly taking on her debt. There is uh, rumors going around that our degrees don't matter here, but that is greatly changing. The university is also following through with the new president's initiative to raise $30 million in five years. I'm told part of that fundraising campaign will go towards scholarships. Beershaladme, 5 on 2.